All right, mayonnaise is in position. I will. I might vassalize these dwarves just because that way I can get another one. Maybe. Man fridge content waiting for now. I'm pretty sure I can always kill them off later after I vassalize them, can I? Probably. Can I, uh... Yeah, they don't want peace, they want to die. That's fun. I'm, I'm thinking I'll probably do Von Karnstein's just because the casualty punishment rate is also going to be huge if I'm currently doing it. 20% casualty punishment rate right at the beginning of the game. That's going to pay out. Yeah. It's good. I, I, like, how like, the, I like how the vampiric corruption slowly seeping out. It makes me happy. I really would love them to move out of their castle and try attack me in the field, so I can counterattack them. Of course you would. I really just hope I'm not coming all the way out here and then just seeing like. Oh, by the way, they just have, like, an entire army of Grail Guard. Which they They're couldn't... offering me money now for a peace treaty. You know what? You might as well take it. Pay me more. They only pay me 300. Okay, you might as well kill them. You'll get more than 300 from slaying their army. Right. Yeah, right? That's a pretty low amount for someone to be killing this. Hey, do you want me to wipe out your entire civilization? Um, no. Will you take 300? The Red Duke wants a, uh, a peace treaty. The Red Duke's pretty strong. I do have to admit, it would be good not to go to war with the Red Duke right now. Here, I'll take a defensive alliance. Yeah, take what you can. Make real good friends with them. Can you, can you, um, confederate them later? Maybe. They are a vampire faction. Right, can I confederate Luther and Tarkon? <laughs> both vampires. I think he'd be a pirate. But maybe. No, he is. Like, you can't. But I'm just saying I should be able to. Technically, Vlad, being the father of all Von Karnsteins, should be able to, um take the dread fleet that is a fair point that is a fair point i wouldn't mind having the dread fleet they're a pretty strong uh faction i don't think the moot's gonna rebel anymore it might not you've had it okay, for so a few one, turns once i get public order stabilized there I'm, i'll be able to move isabella out and vampiric corruption's coming up nicely oh yeah three percent per turn and minus four percent untainted there's a slight chaos corruption, but it's going to completely vanish. I think I'm going to save up some uh, dark magic and build an ancient armory in um, Castle Templeoff. Well, no, I can actually build that in another one. I can build that somewhere else. So maybe I'll get the... Um, do I want Vampire Crypt or do I want Midden? Library. I mean, for a small settlement, you should consider building the ancient armory so you can get your high tier units. Yeah. I don't know. Hex race could be a thing too, though. They're really, really good. Are they? Well, because they're ethereal. Which uh, means. Okay. They take almost no damage from physical damage. Uh, so I think I am going to build a gibbet in Fort Oberstar and just make that an economic province. Because I already have a carnal pit there for growth. So. Yeah. I need to save a slot in all my settlements for garrison buildings because I have dwarves on every side. The Rotten Gift. Armor plus 10 for zombies. 
I'm just not as worried about that because we're not doing the vortex and so we're not doing rituals. Like, the dwarves are usually defensive, but when they attack, it's not good for me. Alright, so I don't need to build anything here because I have to wait till tier 3 to build anything more. Let us upgrade any of these, really. How long have you been live for? My cruelty knows no A while. Into the night. They have two stacks. By Sigma, no. Look at all the range units they're recruiting. No. They have a mortar. They can't be having a good time, though. They're barely holding on to public order. They're making basically no money. So I don't know how they're recruiting all that. They must have some coffers going. Anyway, if I hang out about here, maybe I can lure them to come to me. Kislev has a strategic location for vampire counts. I really want these guys to send just one of those stacks to poke me and not send both because that'd be annoying. If I had blood knights and I could rush the first one before the reinforcements came, it'd be okay. It'd probably be not what I want. This is not what I want. Yeah. And my army counts as being tired because I was in raiding stance. That's aggravating. A little bit. So they have one, two, three, four. I they, wouldn't fight that. I wouldn't fight this. Like I, I, I would run. I would, I would. I'm hoping though that they can't make it back to the castle, and I can pick one of them off. I'm not in raiding stance right now, so at least I get my vigor back. I have no choice now because they've pursued me. Fuck. I do have a, I do have dire wolves, so if they don't defend their artillery. If you kill that artillery, you have a much better shot. <laughs> if I can sneak some wolves out into the woods and flank them, then it'll be a rough fight. Make no mistake, it's a lot of dues. And I don't have the dire pack anymore. Where do I want to go? Maybe here, because I'll give me cover all the way down to here, with some luck. <laughs> they attacked me, which means they have to come to me. So... Hide the zombies in the woods. Hide the skeletons behind them. The zombies are meat shields here. Grave guard. Skeleton spears. The downsides, I also won't be able to see them. Uh, corpse cart. And gorse. I can see them. Alright. They still can't see me. They're gonna form up. So 
useful, I'm going to try and get the dire pack down there. I'm going to walk them. So I was reading through the special buildings that Clan Skyer gets in um, in non Vortex and Mortal Empires. Yeah. Jesus Christ, they get Skaven Blight. Yeah, they start in Skaven Blight. Damn. I told you this already. Yeah, but I didn't realize what they got for buffs. So tense right now. They've got their artillery embedded right in the middle. So they won't be able to pull anything tricky. Having said that, they might bring their artillery so close they'll just caught get caught in the mob. But they absolutely will not be able to see my units until they're really close. I get three uses of Awaken from the Grave, which summons a pretty powerful unit. Okay, the stone spread out a bit more. Dogs are almost in position. they not know where you are? No, they can't see me. That's the bee's mean. They have a pretty good hunch. I have to be in, like, the only large forest, but... How far can I spawn him? Not very far. Okay. Clash! Cut it out! What's he I'm, doing? I'm just waiting for them to leave their artillery a little bit too far behind. They have mortars. They still have cannons. I think they're like a big ass cannon unit. Yep. Once this battle line gets to here, their mortars should be about here. And then. I will send the dire wolves in. They're going to see this unit soon. I mean, they're playing it smart. I'll give them that. They're skirting the edge. Just dying, don't mind me. Ah, oh, they kept their mortar up front. I sent the White King out first, but they saw some zombies. I'm gonna hold my dire wolves because I haven't noticed them yet. The White King gets summoned, and um, it's a pretty strong character. I can summon him two more times. Let's just see what they do. He runs faster than their units, actually. I just want to see how they form their lines, like send the wolves in, because they're still moving their army around too much. Oh. 
probably getting a lot of friendly fire out of that too. Frightened. They're not doing so well. So it happens when you wear like colors like that to battle, I guess. Send the zombie horde in. Mortar went off. The mortar did a lot of damage to him. I'm gonna have my wolves run across the back line. They're gonna be seen, but I need them in this other woods. They may go. I don't think those. they isolated their mortars enough, unfortunately. <laughs> And units are revealed. Yep. Battle is going. Now I have area of effect healing now. So there's that. Okay. Here we go. The assault and the mortars I've been building up to the whole time. Plate connects. Caused a mess of them anyway. The wolves are probably done, but took a chunk off. So I was reading through the um, some of the leaks for Total War Warhammer 3. Yeah. Um, Creative Assembly has confirmed that they wish to implement all the main races of Warhammer Fantasy as playable factions by the end of the trilogy. Sweet. So Chaos Demons, Chaos Dwarves, Ogres, like, those are going to be guaranteed to be in it. Nice. That's playable faction. But Steve's? Uh, not in uh, Fantasy. Oh. They really should do a non fan Okay, one. I'd be scared. Jeff is dead. I mean, I'm dead. You, like, massively cut out. No, they should definitely do a Warhammer with the, uh, the 40k universe. Okay, yeah. I, sh I shattered the mortars. I'm swinging my dogs around before they get caught with spears. Having their artillery, though, is going to be awesome. Can you swing your their dogs kind of like, or your dogs kind of like this? I want to, but that's not the way the battle's turning out. They're dire wolves, Gabby. See? Hit these guys in the back. And before they turn around and I get pinched, I pull the wolves out again. <sighs> Basically, I just gotta hold the line and let my shock cavalry do its work. I don't know if you win this, but you're making a really good go at it. If I win this, then the castle will be easy to take. Oh, yeah. And there's still the White King tearing up their shit. Wait, who? Uh, I can I can summon the White King with my Awake in the Grave ability. White King? Who's that? It's this question mark one. Us? This guy down here. He's just defeated, again. He's also another leadership. I didn't even see him. He gets around. I was trying to find him. Like it was a model book. Is that awakened from the grave? Yeah. Oh, you get a unit of Graveguard. Well, Helm and Gorse gets... I believe his name is Krell. 
gets what? Oh, White King. There it is. Yeah. The Free Company Militia are destroying the Dire Wolves. <clears throat> Let the wolves charge in the back of these spears. They're gonna die, but see if they can pull something out of it at least. Ooh, I need a heal, but I want to get one more White King out into their archers. Need to wait 75 more seconds. Okay, why aren't you guys in combat? Get in combat. If you do not have a combat, I will assign you a combat. My grave guard would be pretty rough too. Can't overcharge it. <sighs> Gotta drop a heal. It's more important. Fortunately, I didn't heal them early enough, and they broke. <laughs> I have enough for the White King still. Drink my potion. There's just so many range units, which is a rough fight for me. Okay, where are you, zombie? You need to come over here. Actually, come into there. Push those guys off. You can come over here. Center blob as you know, healing off left and right. Yeah. And their pistols are almost out of ammo. That helps. Grave guard are back in the fight. Where'd you spawn them at? I, I start with them, they're one of my starting units. They're just... Oh. They're starting to get I thought you, I thought you'd use your spell. No, I need to wait a little bit longer before I can use Awaken from the Grave to, to get the White King. Man, these crossbowmen are really annoying. If Hellman goes down, though, I still have Manfred. I just may lose a chunk of that province while I'm moving him. There's just, I don't have enough abilities to really do anything at this point. And their units are holding forever. Like, they're supposed to take fear from the undead. But their crossbowmen are going to be at Wednesday, even though they don't have a lot of them. If I had one more, if I had the dire pack, or just one more dire wolf. Got a 
alley over here. card over here but it's tied up yeah that's it everyone's falling apart Probably if they didn't have... Like, I, I took out their mortar, which was good. But if they didn't have the crossbowmen, I probably could have held line long enough to beat them. I still would have had to retreat and heal. Alright, I can't overcharge it, so I'm just going to have to use the regular spell. So this one summons the Grave Guard, but the Overcharge version summons the White King. So is the White King like a unit of Grave Guard, or is it actually a hero? It's a hero. He has a command aura. I'm pretty sure his name is Krell, from the story. But yeah, I couldn't overcharge the spell, so I just had to do the Grave Guard. It's a summoned unit, so it's going to die anyway. It's unfortunate. If I can get the corpse cart over here, though, we can last a little bit longer. And, like, all the units are absolutely terrified of the Grave Guard spawning in the middle of them. Like, look at this route that's happening, but my summon unit's going to degrade soon. Look at the route, though, Durf. It's so close. Yeah, no, you nearly had it. That's it. They, cr they fell apart because they were summoned. The corpse cart's the worst thing to lose, because it takes a long time to build that back. <laughs> it was a valiant defeat. Some of the mortar units survived because they shattered. At the very least, I don't think they'll be able to mount a counter offensive with what's left of their forces. Maybe the game was so shocked by the loss it just took the piss. There we go. Boss Scarecrow Banner, which isn't useful for him, it definitely hurts me. <laughs> um. I'm being uh, scolded for joining another Make Your Own event. <laughs> Everybody's just like, Prince, no! Yeah, they are retreating, so... <laughs> There's that, at least. Oh, and their public order is going down because there's no one in the castle. Threatness. 
Yeah. He wanted a non-aggression card. I think we can, you want to just conclude here, brother? Uh, yeah, we'll end here. So thanks for watching. Um, it was exciting being able to actually use my streaming PC for streaming. I'll try and improve it even further next time. Uh, just getting it working was kind of a miracle. But, you know, we'll continue the campaign on and off camera on both of our channels. See what happens. Oh, yeah. And uh, if you do come across this and you found it entertaining, Follow us, Hadil, Durf, myself, everyone else. Linked somewhere on our channels. They're all there somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, folks, you on YouTube. Hit the like button, help us a lot, subscribe if you want to see more, and ring the notification bell if you want to know when I post my content. We'll catch you next time. Bye now. Goodbye. Goodbye.